Normally, all configuration of the Factory Talk directory is done automatically during installation of Factory Talk Services platform, so there is no need to run the Factory Talk directory configuration wizard. The Factory Talk directory configuration wizard is used when circumstances require a manual configuration of Factory Talk directory. A Factory Talk administrator account becomes locked and you need to reset the account. A password expires to a Factory Talk account and you need to change the password. When the wizard is run for the first time, it adds the Windows Authenticated Users group to the local directory. The Authenticated Users group is used to override security in the local directory by granting access to all authenticated Windows user accounts. Whenever you run the wizard to reconfigure a Factory Talk local or network directory, the wizard backs up the original directory. The backup file for the local directory is called local install asterisk dot bak and the network directory is called network install asterisk dot bak. Backup files are located in c colon backslash program data backslash rockwell backslash rna server backslash backups. Use the Application Manager to rename, copy, delete, backup, and restore local station or network station Factory Talk View SE applications. When you backup a local or network station application file, the files are saved with a .apa extension. If you restore an application from a .apa file, the HMI server will be restored to the local computer and will not need to be rehosted. For Network Distributed Factory Talk View SE applications, the Application Manager only allows you to rename and delete applications. Use the Distributed Application Manager to backup and restore Network Distributed Factory Talk View SE applications. When backing up Network Distributed applications, archives are saved with a .apb extension. Before restoring an application, make sure the target application is closed and not in use. You can customize the scope of the restore. You can restore the HMI project files only, the entire application, or the entire application with the Factory Talk directory. HMI Server Backup and Restore allows you to Back up Factory Talk View SE HMI servers while they are running. Restore a standalone system. Deploy a distributed system from one set of computers to another. If you are backing up an HMI server, you must run the HMI server backup and restore utility on the same computer as the HMI server you want to back up. Any new tags or alarms you added since the backup was made will be lost when you restore the HMI server project. Read the information on the screen and drag the given options to the matching target spaces.